Doesn't anyone care about the looming water shortage in Scottsdale? In June, the federal government ordered unprecedented water cutbacks, asking Western states to reduce their water use by as much as 30 percent. Arizona is still in a long-term drought that is leading One Valley City to take action. We're talking about Scottsdale. It's asking people there to use 5 percent less water this year, and this is the first step in the city's drought management plan. We've actually asked our, our folks to save 5 percent this year alone. Developers are trying to rush through approval of six high-density apartment projects before the end of the year. These projects total a whopping 3,467 units. Here are the individual numbers. Optima, 1,400. Gold Dust Apartments, 225. 9,400 The Village, 219. Mercado Courtyards, 273. 3,200 North Scottsdale Road, 150. The Park, 1,200. According to the EPA statistics on water usage, each person uses 80 to 100 gallons per day for indoor use. So let's use the gold dust apartments for our example. An apartment project with 225 units would use between 18,000 and 22,500 gallons per day if one person lived in each unit. But in actuality, an average of 1.5 people live in each unit. So a more accurate number would be between 27,000 and 33,750 gallons per day. That would total over 10 million gallons per year. Now, can you imagine the water usage if all six of these projects are built? Over 150 million gallons per year. As more people move here, they will use water not only for their residents, they will also use water at work and at play. If we continue this growth, we will be robbing future generations of the quality of life that we have come to enjoy in Scottsdale. So why would the City Council even consider approving more high-density, multi-story apartment projects? Don't they care about the water? <laughs>